A series of 21 earthquakes have taken place within the course of merely a 90 minutes in Japan. Now, the death toll in this catastrophic incident has risen to 30. Meanwhile, rescue operations are underway at this point. With us on the broadcast is my colleague Akshit Gupta. Akshit, what details can you give our viewers? We're getting to know that the death toll has risen early in the morning. We had tracked 6. It had doubled to 12 and now it is 30. Hatti, what can you tell our viewers? Yesterday, Japan has been a series of earthquakes, and uh, if we can just uh, tell you the latest, uh, then of course uh, the dead toll uh, now has reached 30, uh, and tens of thousands of people have already, uh, you know, evacuated their homes in Japan. Uh, yesterday, only after a powerful earthquake triggered tsunami warnings also and devastated towns on the country's main island of Honshu. Uh, well, uh, as we speak, the dead toll has risen to 30 as rescuers, uh, you know, uh, uh, face. Uh, because uh, what Prime Minister uh, Fumio Shida uh, also described uh, it as a battle against time to reach more trapped uh, under collapsed buildings uh, because a 7.6 magnitude uh, earthquake actually uh, you know sent the shockwaves uh, uh, around the whole country uh, and um, if I, if I just also tell you that uh, more than 140 uh, aftershocks continue to rock Japan uh, today also. Uh, now the strong warnings about the strong tremors uh, are also being given uh, for the coming days. And uh, hundreds of buildings have already collapsed uh, in many areas including uh, Nigata, Toyama, uh, Fukai and uh, uh, Gifu. Uh, and many people have also been uh, have also been uh, joined, and um, the epicenter, uh, the Noto Peninsula, uh, also you know many roads have been damaged, uh, and uh, relief and rescue work uh, is you know actually becoming more and more daunting. For more such videos, subscribe to the NewsX YouTube channel. Hit the bell icon.